Hi and welcome back. Today we'll dive into the more complex active components embedded in our SANWIS breadboard and show how we can use a multiplex LED current driver. Let's start with a quick overview of the complex active components embedded in the SANWIS breadboard. These components are integrated into a system on chip or SOC and include both analog and digital elements. SANWIS breadboard includes the following analog components, four op amps, four comparators, two programmable amplifiers, three digital to analog converters with selectable current or voltage output, various voltage references, and analog multiplexers. These components provide a wide range of possibilities for analog signal processing. On the digital side, we have embedded a large programmable gate array, or PGA, which allows for the creation of numerous digital circuits. Initially, we will provide a range of the most common 74 logic circuits, but there is potential for much more. From these basic components, we can create new, synthesized components, often hybrids of both analog and digital base components. For the initial delivery, the SANWIS breadboard will include several synthesized components, such as a function generator for testing electronic circuits. This is just one example, and several more synthesized components will be included with the first version of the SANWIS breadboard, with many more to follow over time. Another example of a synthesized component is the multiplexed LED current driver. Here's an example of how our multiplexed LED current driver can be used in KiCad. We start by opening KiCad schematics and selecting the component from the SANWIS component library. Then we connect it to the LEDs. This makes setup easier and faster, as we don't need to worry about placing resistors in front of each LED. We are now ready to export the SPICE netlist for the circuit and let the SANWIS wizard guide us on where to place the individual LEDs. Finally, we can test the circuit. That was a brief overview of the more complex active components and how to use a multiplex LED current driver in the SANWIS breadboard. Microware will continuously expand the portfolio of these synthesized components, and you can update the breadboard to the latest revision with the built-in bootloader. Stay tuned for more exciting updates.